Hey guys, it's the Soil Cloth here, and today in this Monster Legends leaky video, we have some brand new leaked monsters, as well as some new leaky events, so let's go ahead and get right into it. Alright, so the first leak is going to be a brand new moveset for a monster named Akithorn, and it is going to be a light and metal support with cooldown restoration, nanovirus control removal, and stamina regen. So it has a single target NER with 30% stamina and stamina regen, which is pretty good. It also has a PER with nanovirus which is really good. Oh, and it applies it twice. It has an AoE nanovirus. It has an AoE restore cooldown, 50% stamina. So it seems okay. It doesn't have an AoE PER or an AoE NER, which is kind of disappointing, but it seems okay. Okay, I guess. And then we have a skill update for Eternal Bastet. So these moves got updated and she can now do Earth Protection. She can do Curse. She can do Earth Weakness to all enemies. She also has a Light Weakness to one enemy. She has another Curse move and an AoE Curse. So yeah, definitely way good skill updates. All these are making her moves way, way better. None of them make them worse. And then we have Akathorn's description if you want to go ahead and read that. And then we have Spring 2023. So pretty much you'll just be able to collect Spring Tickets and you Use it to get Coralia, which is amazing. And then it looks like you'll be able to buy the Walking Dead monsters again for some reason. They said that they would never be back, and now they're back, and now they're saying they're never going to be back again. So I'm not sure if that is something you want to do, but if you're buying them because they'll never be back, that is not a good idea because they will probably be back. But I guess if you really want them, go ahead and buy them. And then we have some time challenge changes in the season four. It looks like instead of where this season they gave you the seasonal summon tickets where you could get the ancestor next season they're not giving you those so you won't be able to get an ancestor so it looks like there either won't be an ancestor or it will be very very hard to get and then there's a new multiplayer monster called liza we have its traits right here we got immune to fear attuned and we have gained true vision which is not a good trait at all and then we also have liza's description if you want to go and read that then we have alina's description eternal bestet's description and helma tout's description so yeah, if you want to go and read any of those, go ahead and pause the video here. And then we have a new faction, Coliseum, Arena Tears, so you can use Stone, Bronze, Iron, Steel, or Titanium. Which, yeah, all of those sound pretty cool. And then we have some new designs. We got Eternal Bastet right here, which looks really cool. I do actually really like that design. And then we also have Akathorns right here. We have Aulinas right here. And we have Liza's right here. So all of those look very, very cool. I do like them all. And then we have a Monster with Crazy Event, Random Cells. So you'll be able to get Random Cells, which is very interesting. Apparently, you can either get 5 Random Galactic, 5 Random Blossom, 5 Random Doom, or 10 Random Legendary. Which, none of those are really new so that's kind of disappointing but you can still get some pretty good monsters out of that and then we have akathorn's evolving tree we got rank zero artifact rank one cooldown immunity and rank three area control immunity which is pretty good actually and then we have some brand new golden legends quest challenges so you can extract cells craft relics level up relics play live duels and fight multiplayer battles and then we have the season four abyssal era event checklist if you want to go ahead and look at where any of the monsters are going to be in and then last but not least we have a brand new event called the faction coliseum in which it did say something about that up there and you'll have to use tickets to open it or coliseum cards so yeah definitely try to get coliseum cards when it comes out so that you can try out the new event and yeah those are going to be all the leaks for this video don't forget to like share and subscribe more videos like this and i'll see you guys in the next one goodbye